You guys just don't notice. It don't taste good. It don't taste good. It doesn't smell good. It don't smell good. It smells like fish, do it? It smells like fish, yo. Is it two legs? Legs? Fish legs. Fish legs. Bye bye legs. Alright, alright. Let's get some rice in there. I think then, that's enough onions. That's enough. Because oh. you guys don't like too much onions, right? I don't like but I like Yeah, let's stab. Sea sauce. That to make the rice taste good. Go ahead and mix it. Mix it Be careful. Up. Keep it in the bowl, okay? Stick it in the chip. Keep it in the chip. All right, girls, you ready to eat? Yeah. Thank you for helping. Yeah. Thank you for helping. Let me give you a kiss. How does it taste? I don't know. Sometimes the eggshell drops in there, but it's okay. Does it taste good though? How's your natto rice? Daddy, I accidentally swallowed an egg. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's not gonna hurt you. How do you like it? No comment. He doesn't like it. <laughs> Hey, don't do that! Don't do that, you can hurt your eyes. Oh, hi, I've got that mask. I totally love it. A little we taste of Japan. We love you. We all pretend we are all bubblegum twins. Okay. The first we oh. have is so fine. Oh, okay. <laughs> boo! Boo! <laughs> wow, you guys look just like twins. We're off to the movie theaters. Oh, like geez. old people. We're gonna go see finally Mission Impossible. Snap! I didn't watch the last one. At all? I watched like half of it and then I fell asleep. Remember? Uh. A couple weeks ago, we were on a roll watching Mission Impossible, literally consecutive days, and we watched every single one up until I think it was the fifth. I fell asleep halfway. I mean, not because it was bad, it was just because I was really tired. So I told myself, okay, I'll finish it before we go to the theater. But that never happened. Benji today is like, okay, we gotta go see the movie before they switched Mission Impossible into the smaller theater. It's just the Anyway, theater. this is the stinky theater. <laughs> they we don't have... clean it there. I don't get it. Well, I mean, they probably just don't deep clean. I don't know, it's an old theater. We called just to make sure and they said yes. Mission Impossible is in the stadium seating. I can't think straight. And I'm so hungry because I forgot to eat breakfast. I had banana and coffee. Oh, I brought an orange. And I didn't want to do my makeup, so I just put lipstick on. Yeah, it's just one of those mornings. Hey, we have some spare time to get food. I was waiting in line to get popcorn. It was a super long line. And Benji asked the lady how long previews are. They're 30 minutes. They used to be 20. Ooh. How about guacamole and some chips? I think we're good. See what I'm saying? Just got out of the theater. First off, that guacamole that I bought <laughs> at Red Meyer was 
horrid. It was literally the worst guacamole I ever had in my life. It tastes like poison. I just can't believe somebody would make guacamole that bad. Oh, and the movie was good. It was long AF, but it was a good movie. Tom Cruise, he's kind of hot. Old hot guy. Yeah. <laughs> Today we're making lumpia. The ingredients, ground pork. Of course, the lumpia wrapper. One should be enough. We always cut it in half, so it goes a long way. That's the Filipino way. <laughs> we need onion, some garlic, some green onion, and carrots. Oh, I forgot to get the water chestnuts. My mom would put it inside and it gives it that nice, like, crunchy texture. And last but not least, the chicken bouillon cube. To give it that flavor. Okay, I cut way too many carrots. ASMR. Well, this is far from ASMR. Are you kidding Funny. me? All the screaming. Okay, nice and mint. Minced. 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 Are you saying this wasn't minced well enough? I don't think it yes. was. Yes, done. If I got like a food processor, what would oh, it be? Well, just, you can mince it. What you do is you uh, slice it with a mandolin first. So this is the meat and vegetables mixed together. So I wrapped some sample ones. We want to test it out first before we wrap all of them. And I have my handy dandy helper things at the JB. I didn't realize the wrapper I got, they're like individually wrapped. So this is tedious work. I totally got the wrong loop yet. You know when daddy was a little one? I actually helped Obacha make lumpia. Yeah, of course lumpia is a Filipino dish, but my mom, she made lumpia growing up and I would help her. My mom claimed that she had me help because I have little fingers. I think she just wants someone to help her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm making a little sauce here. I've got uh, some chili pepper, green onions. Also gonna add a little bit of soy sauce. Just a little bit, not too much. Then a little bit of rice vinegar for that sweetness. Oh my gosh, and that's my lumpia dip right there. Oh, I think it's too hot for you to even enjoy. Oh, good. Oh my gosh, this makes me think of mom. Mm -hmm. Like, what, every time she would get ready for a party. Mm -hmm. Done. I think that's about 60 in there. I don't know, but that took way longer than expected because I made them pretty small. Anyways, uh, oh my gosh, it's already 7.30. It's bedtime. The kids are sad because daddy's at the gym and they want to get hugs and kisses. What? 
the seeds? No, you move on sneeze. You sneezed? Yeah. We had extra wrappers and I'm like, honey, what should we put in it? His response was cheese. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Is it gooey? Mm -hmm. It's so good. For everyone that likes mozzarella sticks oh. at restaurants, this is literally 10 times better than a mozzarella stick. Mm. So if you're Filipino and you have these Filipino wraps, sir. But it's not mozzarella though. It's like, I don't it's care. cheddar. And what cheese is it's that? It's just cheese. I think I may have tried this once before, but. My mom came up with this idea. Yeah, yeah. Freaking, right? Right? Honey, good job. <laughs> Honey, seriously. I'm shocked. Yes, it's amazing. Seriously, like, why would Choo -choo. you? But what? And you don't know what cheese is? Cheddar? It's like a like it's like a white cheddar. And that crunch. My. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Where is this it? Right there in the drawer. We ended up using Beecher's cheese, which is a very famous Seattle cheese. It's delicious, one of my favorite cheeses. The Beecher's cheese, you can't, it doesn't cut up as fine. It actually is a little crumbly. Pretty sad the kids are asleep right now because they would have loved to try that. All right guys, we're gonna call it a night. We'll see you tomorrow, night night. Night night, honey. Peace out.